All right, guys, welcome back. The amp of the week is the Boss CE-102 100-watt peak power amplifier. This thing is tiny. This is my first time to do a one of these tiny little amps. Man, we are just right to the gut shot, right out of the gate, aren't we? Let me get this thing to focus. There we go. All right, there's the gut shot. Look at that tiny little transformer. And then we got some capacitors in there. <laughs> well, that's what you get. Um, the Boss CE-102. Um, I'm gonna try to put this video out first this time. Um, again, this is my first time to test one of these tiny little small little amps. I could do some more um, if y'all would like for me to. And, uh, you know, just let me know. But, um, anyhow, there's some, some of the, um, for the side-by-sides, you know, they're like weatherproof and, um, we'll, you know, we could do some of those if, if we need to, but make sure you check out my other videos. We did a couple dyno runs on this. We listened to it and, uh, all the usual stuff. So I will tell you this, here's what you get with the amp. You get these kind of wire connectors for the uh, positive ground remote and then speaker outs. You get high level ends, uh, but it also has low level ends. You get some mounting screws and some literature. I will tell you this, the owner's manual is extremely simple. Um, it does not have any power ratings in it. And that's it. So um, there's the back plate. Um, I did uh, I did go online and print off some uh, some stuff from the website. Let me grab that real quick. All right, um, this looks familiar to you. All of the bosses. Let's see what else was it. Anybody that's owned by the same company, um, they have the same type of stuff when you go online. So when I print them off, they look the same. CE-102, and CE does stand for Chaos Epic. Um, <clears throat> Two-channel, full range, class AB, not bridgeable, um, 100 watts. Right there, you can see a uh, RMS rating. Up to 38 watts by two at four ohms. That's the lowest that it's rated to go is four ohm stereo. Um, make sure you check out my... Um, Dino runs to see what it actually did, and there's the price right off of their website $42.89. But that's not what it cost on Amazon. I bought this on Amazon at regular price, uh, which at the time I bought it was $27.74, and with tax, it was $29.96. Anyhow, this thing uh, is less than a pound, I'm pretty sure. Um, Here's the high level inputs. It's really hard to read the stuff that's on this mirror finish. There's black writing on there that you can barely see, but there's the high level inputs, low level inputs, and it does actually have, um, gosh, I'm trying to read it. It has a, uh, a fixed filter. Anyhow, and then the, uh, there's your gain. And on this side, you have the uh, speaker outs. That is, for this one here, the, the black and green goes in there. And then for the power and all is the over here. Um, and then just one LED. So uh, that's it. There's not a whole lot to talk about. Uh, my other videos are pretty much going to say everything about this so uh i'm gonna keep this overview short and sweet all right thanks for watching